European Grand Prix in Valencia. It reminds me of generally nice weather that time of year. People are pretty relaxed, so generally a good atmosphere at the track. Valencia, 5.4 kilometres through the harbour, 57 laps in all 308 kilometres. Five high speed stretches, six low speed corners, two possibilities for overtaking, top speed 306 kilometres. Here we are in the Red Bull Simulator at Valencia, the street circuit. Full throttle through the first corner, braking very, very hard for the first chicane. Once you finish braking, get the car lined up, ready for, for turn three, accelerating hard away, very close to the wall on the exit there. Arrive very, very quickly into the next chicane, using a bit more curbing here. Slightly different chicane to the first one. You need to get a nice, clean exit here. A very tight right-hand corner to entry onto the bridge. In very, very tight and easy to have problems with the rear of the car here, over the crest. Very tight corner leading onto the back straight. We now have the water on our right-hand side. A long, long straight here, big top speed. Braking very, very hard for this tight right-hander. End of the long back straight. Quickly into a left-hander, followed up by a slightly opened right-hander, which is very easy to run close to the wall there on the exit. A longer straight here, but with lots of little kinks in it, so you need to be careful there's no cars that have stopped behind those kinks. Braking very, very heavily again for a tight right hairpin. Make sure you get the car nicely positioned, ready for a very fast last sector. Driver needs to be very, very accurate through here and quite a challenging part of the track for him. We then have a little relax before we arrive at the last corner. It's very tricky to get right as we have braking and turning at the same time. We go inside the pit entry and then accelerating hard onto the start-finish straight to finish a lap at the Valencia circuit.